straps is a huge part of circle skills. And the best part about the straps is that they push on the bar more because they don't worry about peeling off. Is where when they're on the regular bar, they have a tendency to pull a little bit. So this combined with the drills over there will create the best circles ever. So Daria Ellis is gonna show you step one. And again, it's the same as we did on the bar. Tucking around the bar and then going to straight. She just learns to get around what it means to rotate and shift. Then you see the legs go straight, the head goes down. Very good, Darielis. Continuing on with multiple circles. Once they have mastered the tuck, the straight to tuck, and the multiple straight legs, now it's time to get lighter and be able to shape onto the landing surface. This can be blocks or it can be the bounce trainer. So you're gonna see the hips drop, lay toe on, come around and shoot your feet off. Very good, Lily. Push on the bar. Keep pushing, rounded turtle back and jump off. Very good. Once they have figured out how to do this, it is now time to actually do a half of a toe handstand. So Lily is gonna take the toe handstand to a push-up shape right as she comes off the bar. This requires a little bit later drop in the hips, toes under the bar to shape keeping the elbows locked the entire time. Very good. Now, for the stalder, for the inside, same exact repetition of drills. All right, Lily? So she's gonna do the same late drop, but now she's gonna step into a stalder shape to create the stalder to handstand. Nice shaping. And now last and the most difficult is the inside stalter, but of course also the highest value. Good job, good job, all right. So just remember, once you master circling, changing the shapes is the easy part but making sure that the kids have straight arms, the right body shapes will make going from one to the other very, very easy. Okay, we're gonna continue on with the circles in straps. We're gonna be doing some of the same drills that Lily did on the bar. We're gonna do them on the straps, Darielis. So we're gonna start with the circle shape and get to a hollow position, maintaining the shape that we wanna see on the toe handstand. Correct, let's do that one more time. So she's maintaining her body shape, keeping her head in. Hips down, a little early, and hold. All right. Now, we're gonna go on and we're gonna do a full set. She's gonna do three toe handstands in a row. She's working really hard at this phase of her development to teach herself how to get her hips to horizontal and make her toes go under the bar. Common mistake, drop the hips and then the hips go back when they toe on the bar. So the hips need to go under as the feet circle under to the bottom of the bar. All right, we'll do three. Under the bar, no, no, fall with the hips, fall with the hips, push back. Fall, stay up here. Let your hip bones drop, toes go under the bar. Little better. All right, good job, Darielis.